Good morning guys, it is Monday and if I could choose, honestly, I would stay in bed. <laughs> it's been a very long week or the past two, three weeks have been very, very long. I haven't really been able to relax and kind of rest. So for once, I kind of dread that it's Monday, but hopefully that uh, will change when I get into work. First, I'm heading off to get my results on my neuropsychology thingy that I was on a couple of weeks ago. So uh, off to the hospital and then off to work. So good morning, guys. I hope you have an awesome day. Well, guys, I am home. Um, I had a really, really good meeting with my neuropsychologist. Uh, they were going to set up some... Um, a, I'm going to get a psychologist with them because they know how to handle like the physical pain and everything and how that is going to be impacting your psychic and stuff. So they can help you find ways to handle that so that you can stay happy which is awesome. Uh, they are very... Um, she... the one that made... I'm not gonna be with the one that made um, my tests. She only works with these kind of tests and then they have other psychologists that is going to take care of the rest of things. Uh, but she's very concerned with me, my sleeping habits because I really it's not that I don't go to bed in a bad, in, in a good point. I actually do go to bed and I actually am in bed for nine hours. But I have a tendency to go up in the middle of the night meaning to go to the toilet. And she says that that is in no way natural and that is in no way how you should live. It has gotten a bit better after I quit taking my nightly medications. Um, of course, my doctor and I had that conversation before I, I removed before we removed them. Actually, her, she who removed them, and I see a good, I see a progress in it. And also, the training I'm doing is actually helping. Um, but uh, we need to kind of look into why I'm waking up as much as I do. And also, I got the kind of um, verified that. I feel that my memory is is getting worse and I'm feeling that it takes me much longer time to think and stuff and verifiable that was what their test told them um, that I am very it's much my memory um, it's much lower than it should be um, when you go it towards uh, my other um, cognitive behavior and stuff like that. So um, it's very good. They verified that what I'm feeling actually is true, and we have to trying to figure out how what to do with it. And one of the things they see is that I do have the sleeping problems uh, and such. So we are going to use all of these different tools to try to get me better because I feel empowered. I feel like we can fix this. I know that I can just run in 150 kilometers an hour straight forward. I have to do things on my end too. I have to more schedule my time better, um, rest more, have periods of time, kind of divide my time a little bit so that I actually do rest when I'm home. Um, so that I can kind of balance the week instead of doing everything on Monday and Tuesday and gradually getting more tired towards the end I'm just gonna try to do equal amounts all through the week and stay at the same level basically so that is awesome and very very good and that was awesome and then I went to work and I had my first meeting as my new role as the facilitator and apparently I hold, held a very good meeting. Um, both uh, we have a like methody, methodology 
driver in the company basically one who drives how how we work kind of agile development stuff like that so uh, she said that it was very good and that felt very very good for me because I I was very very scared doing this but I'm doing it because I really want to do this uh, also my boss said I did a very good job so it's like yeah I got we are going to make this we are going to get this working and um, I'm very very happy about it so yeah that has been my day and then my brother called me and wanted me to make uh, some name stickers so we are going to try to do that um, I have a silhouette machine I've had it for a long time but when we moved when I when we moved rooms I never really unpacked it I have it on the first, on the top uh, shelf here but I haven't really unpacked it I haven't plugged it in and stuff um, I just updated my software and now I'm gonna sit down and try, see if I can make stickers um, I'm gonna talk to my brother a little bit more about how he wants them if he wants them to connected or if he wants them separate letters or how he wants them but he wanted some name stickers to put on a canoe I think so that is gonna be fun and then I have to do um, print a couple of images for Wednesday video and for release that is going up the 3rd of November I think so that is what I'm doing today and I'm going to rest I mean, it's going to be time for that because I'm just going to print the images. I'm not going to make the video or anything today, I think. I think I'm only going to print the images to um, kind of prepare for tomorrow so that when I get home tomorrow I can sit down and color and, and that already kind of come up with a new concept and stuff. So I'm going to see if I can do this a little bit more organized that way that I fix the concept one day and I do the rest of it another day uh, so that I can uh, not do all the video making and stuff in one day and and, and to take it little by little I also want to clean out uh, the sofa in the living room because oh, every, as I told you yesterday everything in the bookshelf is there so I have to fix that but yeah that's my little update we'll see what I do later do want to do some cross stitching but I don't have any cross stitching projects up right now so I have to figure out which one I want to do so yeah that it is Well, I am heading off to bed because I need to sleep and I've done everything that I needed to do and I probably would have needed to clean a little bit more but that is how it is, sometimes you don't. Well, so I'm gonna head to bed, so um, one, one little thing before heading to bed, I just passed 5,000 subscribers on my craft channel, mm, I'm so happy, I don't know why those even numbers matter so much but I've been watching it go towards 5,000 for quite some time now so I'm very very happy that they finally it's finally got there um, you get I have like the, all the analytics and you can see how the the channel grows and due to my health issues uh, this summer I actually declined in the growth so it was actually planned um, if it had gone as it did before it would have ended much earlier but I'm really really happy that I just passed 5,000 so it's 5,000 awesome that's a lot of people well guys I'm going to head to bed with a smile on my face so good night sleep tight don't let the bed bugs bite